Nelson Darwin Park Tech. Subscribe for more videos. It's me, Imad, from Nelson Darwin Park Tech YouTube channel. In this video tutorial, we will learn about the interfacing of a stepper motor with the AT51 microcontroller. We will use 89C51, which is just like the AT51. So you can compile the code both for 89C51 or AT51. So let's get started. First, we need to go to our component mode and we will write here 89C51. Okay, so we will take our microcontroller. This is our microcontroller. After it, we need to take our stepper motor. We will take our bipolar stepper motor. So this is our bipolar stepper motor. Okay, I will make it a little big so we can see it properly. Okay, now. Port 1, pin 0 must be connected with this pin of the stepper motor and the pin number 1 must be connected with the this pin of the stepper motor. The pin number 2 with, sorry, the pin number 2 with this one and pin number 3 with this one. Okay, now this is our hardware. No need to connect any sort of external crystal or any sort of power like uh, power pins because we don't need it at all in simulation. Now we will go towards code. Okay, so this is our simple code. Okay, we will go to file. We will write. Okay, we will go to project. We will write new microvision project. Here we will write stepper motor final so this is our project here we will select 89c51 so this is our microcontroller so we will need to press ok and yes and yes after our project is created we need to click on source group one okay and also click on add new item to group source one here we need to add assembly or dot asm file and we can write any name like step stepper 000 or anything like that it's up to our own choice so this is our stepper 00 and we need to paste our code here or you can write it at your own okay it is very simple code that is we, we are uh, throwing some hexadecimal values on the uh, port one of the microcontroller. So and of uh, and in between these values we have called the delay function which will create some time delay. Then after the completion as jump main again it will throw the control to the start. So after executing this line control will come again to this line and again all these statements will be executed one by one. Okay, so okay. Now we need to sorry, we need to click on target and options for target one and then create hex file and press OK. Now we need to build target and zero errors and it is completed. Okay, now it's a stepper motor final. So we double click our microcontroller. We need to go to our hex file. And here is our hex file in objects. So stepper motor final. Okay, now we will run it out. Now you can see that it will take some sort of uh, very small steps, but it is moving in counterclockwise direction. Now you can see it. Wait for like uh, 10 seconds and it will. Wait. 
okay now it has moved to 13 degrees from the counter clockwise direction all the way the micro stepping is there but still it is moving so it is up to like uh, 17 18 degrees okay now it comes to 20 degrees so hopefully you got this simple concept so thanks for visiting our channel